In Washington, D.C., as well as Maryland, the Blue Cross Blue Shield payer is known as Care First. You might want to utilize this website if you are using claims as far as submitting insurance claims and receiving payment for your services as a mental health provider or any other provider for that matter to create an account here on Care First Direct. You will go to provider.carefirst.com. There you can click on the tab that says for providers here. And we wanna go ahead and click create an account. Now, I like this website because upon many of the insurance and payers, it can be a little bit difficult and tedious to get the access you need to each account. However, Care First allows you to get signed up and have access immediately to the account that you need online by just having the tax ID and billing MPI. So a tax ID is something that any and every business registered in the country of the United States would have. And the billing MPI would be used based on how you and your practice are credentialed with Care First Blue Cross Blue Shield. So if you're credentialed as an individual provider, even though you may have your group type 2 MPI, you want to put your individual MPI here to accompany your tax ID because that is how Care First knows to identify you. Once you enter in the information that you need to enter for your organization, it's going to ask you some very basic questions about your role as well as your information, your personal identifying information. Who are you? Why are you trying to access this account for this particular tax ID and MPI combination? Very simple and straightforward. You'll get an email to confirm your email address, and from there, you'll immediately have access to Care First. Every time you log in, they're gonna send you a multi-factor identifier, meaning you're gonna get an email sent to the email address that you're registered, and you're gonna to have to enter the verification code that you're using, that you're receiving in order to access Care First. The code that is sent to your email address, there's only 60 minutes allowed to authenticate it. The beauty is once you're in, you're in. You don't have to wait for additional authorization from the insurance payer. You don't have to wait for additional authorization from the private practice. You can go ahead and start researching member IDs and dates of birth based on what the Care First card looks like. So here you're able to find your member ID. Then you will just need your client's date of birth. Then you'll be able to research them by today's date of service. Oftentimes what we're doing is looking for eligibility, which is what this gives us the opportunity to look up eligibility and benefits as well as claim status. That is why this is so awesome. You're gonna research this member one time. And there in the next step, you'll find the option to review eligibility, claim status, or benefits. Amazing. You're also able to start with prior authorization tools here and receive notifications for them as well. If you need to get a regular inpatient or outpatient authorization for a medical for the commercial plans or FPP blue plans, you can use this link to get started here. If someone is utilizing a Medicare Advantage Care First plan, so you would get a Medicare Advantage plan through Care First, but you're able to request inpatient authorization, outpatient authorizations here as well. There are also Medicaid plan versions of these plans, and you can also request the authorizations you need here. Blue card are the out of area plans, so you can request authorizations by entering the prefix. It'll locate the area in which you are for and get you redirected. You're also able to do pharmacy and genetic um, authorizations here as well. Other tools that are here feature provider search, referral forms, additional programs and services, resources, manuals, and guides that all are applicable to a Care First provider. But if someone utilizing billing and administration tools, Care First Direct is definitely one of my favorites for insurance payers, especially for those in the DMV area. 